Good day. These are resonance structure notes and I'll do it first for SO3 and the next video I'll do it for ozone. So if I'm doing a Lewis structure and after all my calculations I'm going to find that I need four bonds and those will be from my central sulfur. So hopefully I had no problem with the calculations. I have four atoms that each have six valence electrons, that's 24 electrons. Four atoms that would like 32 electrons in total. 32 minus 24 is 8. 8 divided by 2 gives me the four bonds. So that's a Lewis structure. Now, if I'm doing structural diagram for this, it's going to look something like this because it's AX3 it's got to be trigonal planar. So a fair amount of this is accurate it is a trigonal planar shape but the bond strength and length and is a bit misleading. In fact analysis shows that these bonds are all the same and so another way of representing this is to simply show that the double bond could be in any of the three locations. And so I've just moved the double bond around those three and what we're saying is it's a blend of those structures. And another way is to simply say, okay, that the bond is essentially one and a third. So this is representing a one and a third, one and a third, one and a third. And so it's a stronger bond than a single bond and a weaker bond than a double bond. So that's the first round of resonance structures and we'll do ozone the next one.